اوكي خلنا نشوف البفر اوفر فلو طبعا هذا يمكن اصعب درس فبس رح ناخد نصه اوكي عندنا memory exploits البفر is a data storage area inside computer memory it can be either a stack or heap intended to hold predefined amount of data the simplest exploit is to sim supply the executable code as data trick victims machine into executing it okay uh, code will self propagate or give attacker control over machine يعني إذا حطينا uh, uh, جوا الميموري uh, executable data وبدل بدل information فالماشين يعني it will execute it وهذا رح يكون exploit يعني attack Attack can exploit any memory operation and need not involve code injection or data execution. Pointer assignment, format strings, memory allocation and deallocation, function pointers, calls to library routines via offset tables. Okay, so we have a problem. عنا uh, uh, void يعني doesn't have any uh, return foo is just a function uh, with input uh, of a char uh, a pointer uh, defining a okay a pointer it has an, a pointer input defined as a character and a buffer Okay, char. This is a. Uh, uh, we initialize the buffer uh, size to ten. Then we use str cpy. يعني زي is short for string copy. To copy the buffer. لا, the string. لا, wait. The s into the buffer. Yes, it copies the S into the buffer. Then, okay, we have S and a buffer. Print F buff is buff is had uh, the character backslash new line S. So. رح نعمل print this string is too long for foo اوكي okay. احنا هون بنكتشف انه ال s ال s اللي copied inside the buffer is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 more than 10 اوكي okay. So the size of the uh, S, the contents of S is more than the size of the buffer. For here we have a memory exploit. Because the memory that is predefined is only 10. 10 char. So what happened? The general idea is to give a system a very large string that will overflow a buffer. For instance, a server with a sloppy code, it is easy to crash the server by overflowing a buffer. So, the sloppy code means no, the code is not done well. It doesn't check for the size. It doesn't take the size into consideration. And this is when we say it's a sloppy code. It's not a very good one. It has mistakes. It is sometimes possible to actually make the server do whatever you want instead of crashing. 
and uh, this is done by احنا هلا بنسوي overflow للبفر مثلا اذا البفر مثلا حجمه 10 بنحط مثلا 0 0 0 0 0 10 مرات او 1 1 1 1 1 1 10 مرات بعدين number 11 will be overflow so we can put an executable code at number 11 and it will trick the computer the problem خلنا نشوف هون we have a library included uh, we have a main we start our main uh, code we have we have defined a buffer with 15 size 15 and we define integer password equals zero the pass often مش password the pass equals zero uh, we have a print uh, يعني telling asking us to enter the password then it gets buffer okay hi i think it's using this one then if strcmp buff the geek stuff okay so the geek stuff is the password all right if the whatever is inside the buffer equals to the geek stuff يعني if this is uh, if this is true it will pass if it is wrong يعني if the contents of the buffer does not equal the password it will be a wrong password okay else it will be a correct password if the strcmp means like to compare the string compare strcmp معناها compare buffer and the geek stuff so if the contents of the buffer equal to the geek stuff uh, if it does not then it's a wrong password if it does then it's a right password and, and what happens pass is equal to 1 so pass equals to 1 if pass equals to 1 this will execute now give root or admin rights to user print root privileges given to the user then خلاص return 0 خلاص طيب هون في عنا مشكلة ليش؟ لأنه ال buffer is only 15 characters صح؟ وال password is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 اوكي so this um, okay this doesn't matter if these are different doesn't matter what matters is أنا هلأ لو بدي it gets buff means that I'm inputting the password and it's reading it it's reading what I write it's taking it صح gets buff يعني ممكن أنا أكتب الباسورد مليون حرف مليون حرف so البفر رح يكون السايز تبع مليون so هذه رح تكون overflow okay ففي عنا مشكلة هلأ أنا هلا after the buffer بيجي ال pass صح؟ in the memory it's first the buffer then the pass يعني خلنا نشوف عنا مثلا هيك ال memory عنا هون ال pass it's zero بعدين عنا ال buffer okay this is the buffer this one is the buffer this one is size 15 okay if this one is full it goes up it, it fills in this okay so لو أنا بحط 1 1 1 1 أعمل هيك uh, until I reach 
نمبر 16 او 256 actually I'm not sure if uh, 15 ولا 256 okay let's say 15 if I reach the number 16 it will it will overflow the one it will overwrite this will become one so what happens if I do this if pass equal one it will give me root privileges right and this way we hack into this code all right okay what is a buffer overflow the intention is to execute arbitrary code to spawn a remote shell or infect with a worm or virus also it can be executed to cause software to crash by denial of service so there's two intentions denial of service and arbitrary code execution the steps first of all uh, we inject a code into the buffer زي ما عملنا من اول بعدين ال overflow return address return address is overflown with the attack code then it redirects the control flow attack to attack code redirect control flow to attack code يعني pointer مثلا it redirects to the attack code ف it starts to execute the attack code then this happens it starts to execute the attack code stack overflow overview عندنا هذا ال address space هاي زي ما حكينا من أول هذا ال text text فيات ال machine code وال static data هادي بتسميها ال data اللي فيها ال un لا فيها initialized data هادي static ال BSS اللي هي ال block block آه برضو نسيت system symbol اشي آه by symbol اشي آه symbol صح block by آه اوكي ال heap بعدين ال shared library بعدين ال stack بعدين الكيرنل سبيس C call stack when a function call is made the return address is put on the stack okay لما يسو... لما ال... ال... function call is made return address is put on the stack Okay, return address when fill stack. Often the values of parameters are put on the stack. Usually the function saves the stack frame pointer. Okay, ماشي. كنا عنا function مسيف فيها إيش ال stack frame pointer. هذه هي الستاك فريم بيكون فيها البارامترز بيكون فيها الريترن ادرس بيكون فيها الكولينج ستاك بوينتر وبيكون فيها اللوكال فاريبلز ايش 
هذه ال buffer pointer مثلا لو كانت لو لو صار عندنا overflow ممكن نغير ال return address وهي الله أعلم إيش هذه هذه المفروض stack pointer الله أعلم يا رب أكون صح plus offset وهذا stack pointer وهي address اه هي base frame pointer لا هي هي مش buffer هي base frame pointer smashing the stack for profit and fun alright the general idea is to overflow a buffer so that it overwrites the return address ممتاز يعني أنا فاهمة إشي صح متذكرة إشي يعني بنحاول إحنا نعمل overflow للبفر البفر أظن بيكون بالهيب والله أعلم بلا إحنا درسنا هذا الشي صح هو بيكون عبارة عن ال mix heap and the stack بس هو بيكون بالهيب وبضله يطلع يطلع من الهيب حد ما يوصل عند ال return address بعدين The function is done. It will jump to whatever address is on the stack. صح? We put some code in the buffer and set the return address to point to it. آه يعني مصح في عنا function. What it does is it executes. وبعدين بس تخلص. It goes to the return address. صح? لو لو إحنا غيرنا ال return address وخلينا ال address to point at the code that we wanted to execute وحطينا code إحنا مثلا حطينا attack code في البفر وحطينا ال address فوق فوق على أساس إنه to point at the address of the attack code فإيش رح يسوي؟ رح يروح عند ال ال return address حيقول oh this is the address حيروح على ال address حيلاقوا في attack code They're gonna execute the attack code, and voila, this is attack happen. Attack in in live live attack. Okay, before and after. عنا before buffer overflow. هون ال buffer. هون ال saved stack pointer. هون ال return address. إحنا إيش بنعمل؟ ضلنا نعمل بنكتب أو الإيش بنكتب ال بنحط ال address اللي بدنا إياه. بعدين بنعمل overflow اوكي لحد ما يطلع البفر لفوق فوق 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 يوصل للادرس وهون بنحط الادرس اللي احنا بدنا اياه وبنخلي الادرس pointer to program والبروجرام وين هيو فوين راح يروح راح يعمل point to the program to execute the attack code and it will do whatever you want What causes buffer overflow? What causes buffer overflow? Okay, we took it. We learned that the buffer overflow is because of what? Sloppy code. The gets we used to use to take the password, the input. What's the problem? It doesn't take into consideration the size. It just Takes gets keeps reading 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 reading. But if we use this, then we have the size into consideration. Hadi read user input until first end of line or end of. شو هذه function character يعني زي مثلا end of line زي slash n never get use gets هذه is wrong 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 okay وهذه problem number two 
لما نعمل ستر اس تي ار سي بي واي it does when it doesn't consider the size where's the size copy string of crs to destination يعني لو هاي كانت البفر والسورس كان مثلا طويل راح يكون عندنا اوفر فلو use string copy instead why because it consider the size So this is correct. Spot the defect. Hona, we know that it's using str copy. Does not consider the size. Hadi string concatenate. Uh, it concatenates path to the string buffer. But it takes the size of buffer. Hona, we have to use string copy. I'm not sure if there's a problem or if there's a problem. Spot the defect, Hona. اه اوكي هون اوكي هون string concatenate ال path to the buffer اوكي and text the size of the buffer اوكي مش عارفة اذا هاي فيها اشي غلط I'm not sure بس I think هاي اكيد فيها غلط اوكي خلنا نشوف هاي هذه uh, برضو ما استخدمت string copy فعنا ال prefix هاي it copies the prefix into the buffer we don't know the size of the prefix could be more than 20 this will cause a problem copies the string to prefix to pre string concatenate buffer path and size of buffer String cat's third parameter is number of chars to copy, not the buffer size. So هنا عنا مكتوب في مشكلة مكتوب إنه uh, common mistake is giving size of path is third as third argument. بس هاي مش size of path هاي size of buffer. So I'm not sure إيش المشكلة هون يمكن هاي مشكلة بالسلايد أو في إشي أنا مو فاهميته لأنه Size of buffer is the size of buffer, right? ولا إيش؟ ولا هي هاي ال input تبع string s t string concatenate أصلا مفروض نحط فيها size of path. اوكي انا صراحة بلشت اطفي ف I I think my my brain is stop working so we have a source defined as nine characters destination as nine will char base underscore url كذا so the url is three four five six seven eight nine String copy with the end, so this is correct. Source, so we copy the base URL to the source, and uh, copies base URL to source. 
STR COVID test to source هذه is wrong ليش؟ لأنه we copy the source to destination will overrun the buffer destination Oh, okay. Base URL is 10 chars long. It's null terminator, so source won't be able to null terminate. Come on, head. One, two, three. أربعة خمسة ستة سبعة ثمانية تسعة. what 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 so هاي تسعة it goes in تسعة then هاي تسعة So I don't know, Saha. Okay, so let's move Hadi. ممكن كمان نعمل هذا الاشي لانه it, it terminates if it finds the backslash zero اوكي خلاص okay, 